she's one hot trainer. <laughs> she's one dynamite gal. Hey, Men Gaming, let's play. Let's play. So, are, are, are we challenging the flying from behind? She'll I never see this, our sneak attack. I just was like, oh, God, the viewers can't see me. Because I'm invisible. All right, we challenge Flannery. Um, from... Fl Flannery's actually a pretty cool trainer because she's got she's got a story quirk to her. She took over after her grandpa, so she's still kind of unsure of what she should be. She's like, do I be myself? Do I pretend to be tough? Because grandpa was tough, I gotta be put on the facade. And so when you finally beat her, she kind of comes into her own. But I like I like I like it. You can see the transformation. So you go ahead and challenge her first because you gotta we gotta show cutscene. I was behind her! She says, well, you know, I can save mine, though. Alright. Cool gym, though. I like how it's based off, uh, spas, Japanese spas. Yep. Hot spas. Okay. Welcome! Welcome! No. Oh, wait. Oh, hey, I mean, beauty trainer! You've done well to make it this far! How good to see you've made it here. Let's see, I'm, uh, uh, honored to be serving as the gym leader of... No, 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 you're not honored, you're, you're, obviously you get to be the gym leader, you know what? It's not an honor. I have been entrusted with... No, 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 no. I am Flannery, and I am the gym leader here! No, I mean, I'm Flannery, and I'm in charge here! Yeah, yeah, she's large in charge, she knows her, her status. Uh, you better not underestimate me, just cause... Dare I've not underestimate me, though. I've only been the leader for a short time. I have only... Yes, do... Yes, yes. Although I've only been the leader for only a short time, with my skills I've inherited from my grandfather. I shall, uh, demonstrate the hot moves we've honed here on this land? With the skills I've inherited from my grandfather, I'm gonna, uh, demonstrate the hot moves we've honed in this land. Yeah. All right. <sighs> That's why she's the hottest trainer. Also, because she's a fire type. Her hair's a lot more orange. Mine is red. Slugman! Slugman! Alright. Kind of a tough guy. A few levels higher than me, but it's okay for a Gyarados. Gyarados is her, are trained in the ways of the war. Good, I got the first attack, which probably would have poisoned me, take, making my amount of time. Oh, not something. A makes fire attacks that much stronger. Just teach rain dance. Rain Over dance would really help here. Ooh, that's a bad move. Wow, that did 18 damage. Well, it also sharply. It's, it's you know, it's the last resort. We have no choice left. We have to use the last resort. I wonder if I should have her fight a little bit. I mean, ah! That's, that's fine. That's fine. Get them out of the way now. Get them out of the way now. Torkoal. What is that, a rock fire type? It's a fire type. Fire, fire. It's just pure fire. Oh, okay. I forgot to put a rock berry on Gyarados! Well, that's fine. This, one, this guy's poisoning me. Drop him down a little more. At least the sun's about to go out. It's been about the five turns. Critical hit! Ah, but how many? Body slam. Another slugma. Do I have two slugmas and a, a camper up? Body slam. I guess we go for Wilmer right now. Wilbur won't be able to switch. This is all he's got. Wait, where the fuck did my HP go? Did I not heal before? You didn't heal before. <laughs> Marlin grew to level 27. Oh, nice. One shot at him. Three, two, one, kill shot. He's about to switch it normal. I am going to switch my Pokemon. I need to heal Merlin. That's fine. 
fine. Can most, I... people, most people can take an attack. You, if you need to use Winnie for that, that's what. That's why we brought Winnie as a sacrificial lamb. I mean, it's a camera route, so you know, I could probably just tank it to the face anyway. You might be able to withstand the one attack. Yeah. I don't. We don't care about that Pokemon. Fine. We don't love it. We don't need it. Go, Winnie. You will serve your master's purpose well! And if you live, then you're gonna get some awesome experience. Man, I was scared of Flannery. Didn't have to be. Took her down easy. But in the next battle, Norman. Norman, I actually am scared. I don't got any fighting types, man. I think I'll have to teach Gyarados uh, Rock Smash just to get to the next gym. No, no, I can, I can go the long way around. That was your healing, right? Sunny day. Oh. Looks like you survived. Yeah. You dirty little fruit loop. Alright. Let's switch into Gyarados. You know what, though? I don't think I fought a level 28. Really? Yep. I checked them. Wait, are they lower? They were all level... I think, I think the highest was level 26. Weird, because they have you fighting stronger stuff. Yeah. Oh well. That's, a, that's not that's not a real rule. That's just a self-imposed rule. Well, my Gyarados was level twenty-six anyway. Oh really? Yeah. So you didn't break any rules. We're still we're still following that. Yeah. All right, nice. Ninja. Yeah, her about to burn. Burn, baby, burn. Disco Inferno. Has she used, it? Has she used a heal item yet? Nope. I think it's because you haven't let him get low enough to uh, use the heal. Nope. They, none of the Pokemon have gotten into the reds. They get into yellow, and then I uh, just... Bam. There we go. Gyarados. Oh, I guess I was trying too hard. I've, I, I've only recently become the gym leader. I just got a lot of bonus. I tried too hard to be someone I'm not. I have to do things my natural way. If I don't, my Pokemon will become confused. Thanks for teaching me that. You deserve this. Money. Hashtag dollar dollar holla holla. I got more money than you. I've only recently become a gym leader. I guess I was trying too hard to be someone I'm not. When I don't act like myself, no wonder Pokemon that battle at my side get confused. Thank you for teaching me that. You deserve this. I thought that they were confused. I, I didn't confuse them once. I just used Water Gun. Yeah, you used Water Gun and killed them all super fast. Here we Heat Badge. All Pokemon up to level 50. Even though you get trades from people who obey. Yeah. You completely. And we can use Strength outside of battle. Token of the Appreciation. Shy about taking it. Overheat. Overheat. Oh, for once it's consistent. I think this is the first TM that's been the same. Overheat is a fire type move that inflicts serious damage on the target, but it also sharply cuts the special attack of the Pokemon using it. It might not be suitable for longer battles. It's the last resort. We're even having a Pokemon. Nomal can learn it. It's not even with us. No. no, we have the sacrificial lamb. Yeah, we have the sacrificial lamb that lived. My burn. I bought it. One. Ah, oh, crap. Well, at least I met with it. Usually that doesn't happen. Hey, he, need, he needs to tell you, go back to Norman now, because people are not going to know that on their own. Oh, that's a piece of collection of badges. All oh, right, you may as well have this. Go, dog. Okay, I can get my Route 111 Pokemon. We can train in the... We can train on the in the desert, too. We can go get the fossil. Lots of good stuff are gonna happen now. Wow! It's a relief to see you in one piece! Oh well, you know, last time I saw you was right after battling those Team What's It people! So I was a bit worried thinking about what might have happened to you. Ooh, Ron talks. What? You battled them again after that? And you beat them? Yeah, you rolled me back. 
you really are something else, Ron Talks. I, I mean, you and your team are. I'm pretty impressed by you all. And that pretty stone that's sparkling there, is that the meteorite you got from them? Oh, that's right here. Here. I've been thinking of giving these to you. Go, go, goggles. Go, go, get your goggles. If you put on those goggles, you'll be all set heading into the desert on Route 111. Oh, and isn't that the Lava Reach Gym Badge? So you beat Flannery too? I guess you really are training your Pokemon right. Next up will be challenging your dad, Norman, in Petalburg, right? I'm headed to Petalburg Gym next myself. What the fuck? Do you Why want to go back to a goblin halfway through? I, I, don't, I don't know. <laughs> I just feel like she's... Mean. Oh, she'll warp you to the desert. Yeah. No, or, she'll no, warp me back to Petalburg. Uh, but I want to go to the desert. Yeah. So, no! Oh, yeah? Well, I'll still be here in Lava Ridge for a while, so find me if you like a little company on the road after all. I like you take this too bad if your bag is full. Where's my. Why don't I have. Oh, it might! Why don't I have any. Space in my bag. All right. Charcoal. Is that up fire attacks? That yeah, up that ups me. That ups fire attacks. I don't need that anymore. Oh wait, I could give it to Numble though. Numble's holding soft sand. Yeah, it depends which one do I want more. Well, you get the stab with your fire attack, and that would give you double stab. But I also have double stab with. Brown. Oh yeah. Huh. Well, what else? We we did the battle. You know what? I think the last thing we should do is go grab the fossils. Okay. Um, I'm gonna grab my chop now. You didn't already have a chop? Oh right, we we shift we shifted them out. Yeah, we got. We no longer need the uh, sacrificial ponds. Now I have. Two Pokemon under level 20. Yeah, same here. Should we switch something out for the egg? Alright, so let's go to the desert, get the fossil in the upper right hand corner. Go on the episode. I'm not gonna waste my attack on a my turn on an X or something. Like Dad's trainers. Is that true? So what is my answer moment? Oh yeah, I was I was just gonna use Jasmine. She's the one I need to power level in. You actually have a realistic Pokemon that can be used. Stardust. Yeah, you and me, we can ride on the stand. So this may be the training area. Oh, what? Don't kill that! Catch it, Chet! I was just gonna kill it, Mike. Oh, yep, doing some training. <laughs> Holy flip! Good thing I remembered now! Wow! Sand Shrew. Trap Niche! Trap Niche, yo! No! Having some PTSD there, buddy? Yeah. Oh, this Trap Niche has Hyper Cutter. So his attack doesn't get lower. I'm gonna go with Pocahontas. Okay. Go with Pocahontas. Pocahontas? Pocahontas. Pocahontas. Haunt is haunt. Glad I checked. There we go. The Desert Princess. Pocahontas. Alright, you're still up in that corner. I haven't found you yet. It's up in the upper right hand corner, though, right? Yep. Ah, there they are. So when they fall, one of them is going to, the other one's going to sink into the. Right. Thing. You grab one, and the other one sinks. So. So there's the claw and the shield, I think. Both pretty dang good. So since you got there first, I will let you decide which one you want. I don't know which one's which. I'll take the one on the right. All right. So I'll take the one on the left. Yep. Depending, they're the same. Shield is shelled on. The claw is that awesome scorpion looking thing. Claw fossil. 
All right, and I shall get the she the rook. Oh, it's a. Okay, I guess that's a different Pokemon that has the uh, shield fossil. Yep, yep, it's definitely Generation Four. It's fossil. Now that we're sinking in the sand. Then stand between the two of them and reach out both of your arms. And you, yeah, yeah, right. Whatever, claw fossil. <laughs> Goodbye. I think yours actually gets a cutscene. I think mine just kind of poofs. Oh. Yeah, see, mine just poofed. Yours will actually. Oh man. Not even that. Not even that. Just, just fade to just black. Fade to black. Wow. Wow. You're a 3DS, and that's all you can manage. All right. Well, I don't know what else to do. Like, oh, we're gonna we're gonna have to do a couple hours of training, honestly, dude. Yes, we are. So, I guess we'll just end the episode here. All right. Have a good day, everybody.